The Guardian 1000 Digital Airflow Monitor continuously monitors airflow and provides a digital readout of actual face velocity. The audible alarm alerts the operator when the airflow is outside a preset range. This video will walk you through setting that preset range. Tools required. Calibrated thermal anemometer, tape measure and tape, and a faceplate, which can be made of cardboard, Lexan, board, or anything that needs to be the height of the sash opening and about half the width. Using the airflow test pattern described in the manual, using the averaging technique of two rows in two, three, four, five, or six columns for the two foot, three foot, four foot, five foot, and six foot enclosures, a total of four readings will be taken for two feet, six for three feet, eight for four feet, etc., and then averaged. The two rows have readings taken every six inches from each end and evenly spaced every 12 inches. The first row is located three inches down from the upper sash foil, and the second row is located three inches up from the work surface. Mark off areas where the measurements will be taken. To initiate calibration, press and hold Enter on the touchpad until the main menu pops up. Scroll up or down by using the plus and minus buttons and select Setup, then press Enter to display the Setup menu. Scroll down and select Calibration and press Enter. This will bring up the Calibration Menu Password screen. Select the individual values of 0000, 000, 000 by pressing Enter for each digit. This will initiate the calibration mode. Since small enclosures have a fixed, non-moving sash, the default instructions that follow may not be adequate. The screen will read, open the sash to the normal operating position and measure the face velocity using a calibrated instrument. Since the sash height is fixed, there's no need to adjust anything. Take the measurements using the calibrated anemometer. Once measurements have been taken, press Enter. The screen will read, Low Air Sample. Use the plus minus buttons on the keypad to set the value to the average value measured by the anemometer. Once this is complete, step clear of the sash opening and press Enter on the keypad. At this time, the monitor will sample the airflow. This will take approximately five seconds. When it has completed its sampling, the screen will read Low Air Sample Set and then will automatically continue to the next directive. Using this faceplate described earlier, place it flush to one side of the unit, leaving approximately 50% of the sash opening uncovered. This will function as if the sash is being lowered as requested by the direction on the screen. Using the calibrated anemometer, take the measurements at corresponding points remaining open. Once measurements have been taken, press Enter. The screen will read High Air Sample. Using the plus minus buttons on the keypad, set the value to the average value measured by the anemometer. Once again, when the value has been entered, step clear of the sash opening and press Enter on the keypad. The monitor will check the difference between the lower and the higher values taking approximately 5 seconds. Select Run and press Enter. To verify your calibration, open the sash and listen for the alarm. It should take approximately 10 seconds. If you experience any issues calibrating your monitor, contact LabConco for assistance.